Welcome to Japan. We are here at Mobara Circuit. You may have heard of it, but we're gonna check out this S15 today. And I took a road trip all the way here. <laughs> Arrived in my K car. Let's go check out the cool drift cars. My friend Taro, he's gonna get a ride along in his own car. Um, that is an interesting concept. I like it. So he's gonna drive it. Right? So teacher, uh, teacher. Oh, and then Taro. Oh, okay. Good luck. <laughs> We're getting right into it, so keep in mind, this isn't my friend Toddles driving right now. We're seeing a professional driver. Um, I'm along the straight, so this is where they're gonna enter for the first time. Here we go, let's see it. Man, he sent it. I think this is a really great way to see if your car is up to par from a professional driver's perspective. That's cool to see. It looks like Toto is on his First run of the day, I think, and you guys will get a brief introduction soon, but we are in the midst of it, so it, uh, it's happening quickly. the wall but luckily I think there's hay bales so it cushioned the crash a bit. Seems like he's gonna head for another lap. Let's see how this one goes. That thing sounds so good. SR powered. Ah. No. Oh man, that rut right there is very deep too. today at this circuit that it's gonna be a relaxing day you can just sit down and relax and watch some cool cars while people who want to learn are able to learn and improve their skills without any pressure that is a great atmosphere and I hope to experience that in the US as well Lunchtime just ended and everyone's gonna start heading out and getting their runs in. Let me just take around 
Let me just take a look around pits and see what's going on. Got all these different cars. 14 over here. Yeah. Very calm day considering the other events that has happened in Japan that we have gone to. Here is some more S15s. This one specifically. Similar blue to Toddle's car. Looking good. Plenty of S15s to go around. Stock one over here. Here is a crazy looking S13 hatch. Wow. Looking good. Wow. This thing looks super crazy. I, I wonder if it's in D1 GP or something, but over here we got the purple cars. Got a 13 over there and this one's heading out. Wow. These guys are working on their cars. But they're shredding it today. I think we should get a better vantage point. Oh my god. Here he comes. Toto is struggling on right now is this corner. It's a very big corner and you have to initiate properly. Um, let's see if he gets it today. So let's see how that adjustment is handled on the track. They finished with the rears 15 millimeters going down.
the day has come to an end. Toto improved tremendously compared to where he first came from and I hope to see him again. Just in case I'm not able to get a little interview with Toto before he leaves, we'll just take a glance at his car and talk about it. This is a mixture between a street car and a track car. So he drives us to the track and drifts it fairly often. There is no interior. And along with that, I think he has a pretty simple angle setup. Um, cut knuckles like typical S chassis have. And as for the engine setup, it's an SR. I don't know what turbo it is, but I am fairly positive that it's stock-ish. I know it has some Yashio factory goodies on it, um, just like his harness and all the goodies in the interior. Thank you, Taro. I wish I got to see your car uh, a little more, but we'll do that again when I go to Japan. Arigato gozaimasu. Hi, arigato gozaimasu.